Okay, I want to show you what goes into a typical restoration bath. Here are the ingredients uh, that are involved. You want to start off with a cup of magnesium chloride and a cup of magnesium sulfate or uh, Epsom salt. Okay. Rather than debate which one of these are absorbed better, use both. You'll get you'll derive a wider uh, spectrum of benefits by using both salts. Okay. And then from there, the same sort of concept applies with sea salts, okay? So use a combination of Himalayan or pink uh, sea salts with Celtic or gray sea salts. Half a cup of each will do. Sprinkle in some baking soda, some sodium bicarbonate. It's excellent for your skin. It helps to exfoliate the skin. Add a few drops of calming essential oils such as rosewood or lavender. And then finish off with a splash of apple cider vinegar. Just a touch of apple cider vinegar. And that will help to reset the acidity of the skin. Okay. So you want to soak for about 20 to 30 minutes, but at least 20 minutes to absorb most of the nutrients. And do this about an hour before going to bed, because once you get out, it's the actual cooling effect that helps to induce sleep. Now, you can add a contrast effect to it, uh, a hot coal effect, by soaking in a hot tub and then jumping into a cold shower. So in the background, you'll see that we have our bathtub and a separate shower unit. So you would start off in the bathtub for a little while, and then you would hop into uh, the shower. And you can either do a whole body effect by using the rain shower head above and soak the entire body, or you can localize it on one spot. So you can use a removable shower head and localize it uh, on one body part. So say for instance, you worked your calves yesterday and your calves are particularly sore, you can localize it right over the, uh, the calves, okay? And basically you wanna go about a minute or so hot and a minute or so cold, back and forth for about three to five cycles is best, okay? So try to incorporate a restoration bath at least once a week. You'll find that it'll really help your recovery between workouts.